Hey, you might not know, but prompting is not easy. Actually, you might know because you you try some prompt and they they don't work. And there's a lot of literature about how to prompt. You know, the art of the prompt or prompt engineering skills. So I'm going to try this. I uh, created a document that referenced all the prompt techniques. And I'm going to ask Copilot to use this prompt framework to guide me how to prompt. So I grabbed some content on the internet and I put it in a Word document. So there's a RTF framework, request task format. There's the chain of thought framework, there's the Ryzen framework, etc. So there's a lot of framework in this document. And so I'm going to see if Copilot can help me with this framework to guide me, actually. So let me close this if I can, can grab it now. So let's go to Copilot and let's ask Copilot Oh, there's a new feature this morning. Add people files and more for better results. Good. It's true that here you don't, you don't know that you can add people with this clippy thing, and here it's more uh, visible. Nice, nice move, Microsoft. So let's prompt. Um, please help me to prompt with the support of this document that lists different prompt techniques. Um, Ask me first what I want to do and then suggest some prompts that are appropriate based on the framework. Stored in this document. So let's try that and let's add my file, prompt frameworks. It's right there. And let's go. Let's see if it works. So it's ingesting that and now. I need to find an, a question. Okay, could you please tell me what you like to do with the prompts? So let's say I want to understand what my team is doing about Copilot resources to support the end users. There might be documents, uh, training, or whatever else. Okay, so let's see if you can come with a prompt based on the framework I gave. looking at a document, figure out you know, maybe what is the best technique to ask a prompt for this use case. What are the current copilot resources available for user support within my team? Can you provide a summary of the latest training materials or documents related to copilot to my team has created or to that? Uh, is my team leveraging copilot to enhance and user experience and efficiency? Okay. That's a good start. Let's ask another question now. Uh, so I'm no, I don't want you to find. So uh, what 
but if I want to review uh, press release and extract information to write an email for a specific audience like share holders uh, should I prompt to get the result? So basically, you describe your use case. Maybe I should have told Copilot uh, co to ask me more questions if they needed more context. So to review the press release and extract information for writing emails, go to your user RTF. Okay. Here are some prompts based on the RTF framework that you could use. As a communication manager, I need to extract key points from this press release that are relevant to our shareholders. Looks, looks good. Identify the most impactful statements in the press release that will resonate with you. Okay, so I can start to have a, a better understanding of how I should prompt. So basically, that can be, I don't know why you brought me back a link to, <laughs> to a PowerPoint here. Uh, but he's, he's doing what I'm what I've asked is I asked to help me to write the prompt. So if you're struggling with the prompt, what I will recommend is to work with your team so they can give you a source of a document where all the prompt techniques are stored and you know ask just ask Copilot to use this framework and suggest a few prompts and you might find your way easier and not you know end in a dead end or be frustrated by the prompt and not working it's not guaranteed because you know prompt is first it's an art so it's changes but also it's because it depends on your the quality of your content and it also it depends on the first input you can give as you know the more context you give the better it is so maybe you can change this initial prompt here um, by asking, you know, telling a Copilot that he can ask you more questions to better identify your use case, the context, depending on what is your use case. So you, definitely you can change this initial prompt, but my call to action is create a prompt framework a document that lists all the techniques you can find easily those techniques on the internet uh, they give you you know when you need to use them how, how they work with a lot of details and take it as a source to ask copilot to help you to get better prompts hope this was insightful <laughs>